guys and welcome back to don't to don't let it die <laughs> I don't I, I we were talking about don't starve last time I just take a bunch of water I, f I feel lightheaded <laughs> welcome back to let it die uh, in this video we're gonna be finishing our coverage of the boxing glove guess who still doesn't have it and I'm still grinding like the TDM every stream more or less yeah <laughs> Good. Ah, <laughs> shit. Anyways, not 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 ideal to say the least. But um, what is ideal is you guys. Uh, you guys are always a grade, uh, and that's why I have three more of these. Thank you, <laughs> thank you, uh, everyone else who is watching this and who also wants to see how good these are. I'm assuming are also saying thank you. <laughs> All right. Um, as of our mastery, I use these things a ton. I'm just not sure if they're de like the same as the fists and they just don't level up as much because I don't think we're that leveled up. And I've been using these things constantly. Oh, never mind. We're almost there. Okay, well, <laughs> um, <laughs> it worked out. Um, anyways, uh, attack power increase, attack power increase, a rage move, a stamina consumption, uh, and then our special punch bash, which is just... Oh, no, that, that allows us to like just keep hitting. All right, never mind. That's not it. This is it. Body blow, which looks like more of a nad shot. But okay, rage, attack, gortastic XP. Uh, I really feel like every couple, they should have something special. Like, yeah. I don't think any of them are like that. When you get to like 20, it doesn't like do anything. <laughs> it's not like, hey, the weapon changes. Like, hey, there's a, if you, like more attack speed. Nothing like that. It's always just they get a little more attack power. <laughs> so I don't think we're missing anything with those last two that we can't see. Uh, but maybe we'll unlock them. But in this video, we're gonna be going up against Gato, um, and yeah, uh, the little bitch Gato, and then Big Gato. We're not gonna waste any time because we already wasted a lot of time last time uh, covering these weapons and whatnot. Oh, <laughs> it is summer, guys, and I, I, it's right now. It's not hot yet. It's gonna get hot real fast, but not hot yet. Um, I have a fan there. It's my, uh, it's like a fucking really expensive fan, guys. It's a Dyson son of, son of a bitch, and it's real tiny, but it, the reason why it has to be, it's that, is because it has to be silent, or at least as quiet as it can be, because of the microphone and everything. Yeah, it's just, I, I had to save for a long time. Anyways, <laughs> anyways. Um, but that's not really the problem right now. It's the goddamn allergies. I'm not sure about you guys, I am a broken human <laughs> when it comes to everything inside <laughs> of my body. Nothing works properly. Um, everything is broken. Uh, every time there's like, it's cold season, I'm sick three weeks in advance. <laughs> just because I'm prepping for it. I'm ready for it. Ah, I'm always a harbinger of that as well. It's a bad time, <laughs> is all I'm saying. Um, but yeah, I have a stuffed nose. Every time I wake up, I feel like I'm, my face just got smashed with a brick. I, yeah. Uh, go, 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 go. Bam, and done, and looks sexy. Pow, great. Great. We have so much Candy Wolf black metal. <laughs> it's, oh, really? Slipping in the gunk, in the blood gunk. Please despawn. Thank you. <laughs> All right, God. Um, we're gonna go up top side. We're gonna fight God, of course. But then we're just gonna do little baby hits. Da -da -da. Baby tax. Wall up. There's three thousand. That's not bad. Pow. Sixteen thousand on the heavy slash. Nut punch? Uh, not bad. Hello. Okay, so that's a ranged weapon. Check this out. Pow! Nut punch. Uh, also, apparently, one of you guys were telling me the key to this weapon is to like make sure they're backed against the wall so that they're kind of stuck, because otherwise they'll get pushed out of your radius. All great tips. All. Kind of obvious, but God help me if, if I'm not oblivious sometimes. Pa oh, damn it. Just a little bit out of the way. Maybe not a little bit. It's always that. These enemies are definitely not strong enough <laughs> for uh, for, my, for the weapon. A little bit leveled up. Oh, I am coming off a very, very uh, long recording days. <laughs> well, basically, I just... you guys, Next time you guys see me, um, I may have just, like... A long hair or something because because I have a lot to edit it's so like mo much. mountains and mountains of film god help me if anything got corrupted <laughs> I laugh but I really would and like there's nothing worse than being like oh so that that all gone so now I have to find a way to explain what happened <laughs> and try to re repair what is forever lost great 
Also, all that energy. Also, it really sucks because sometimes you're like, I feel like that was a good video. And then it goes away and you're like, fuck. God, why? <laughs> why? You know, rare I feel there's a good video of me that's like, not of me, but just like a fun thing. Like, we messed around, we had a good time, stuff like that. Uh, as of like a self-improvement thing, I need to slow down. <laughs> On days like this, I feel like I get zippy <laughs> real fast and it's it's present. Uh, John, John Tun? John Tun? The only people that are sending haters after uh, anyone now are specifically the assholes <laughs> who want to kill you, so... Yay! Maybe he's he's a, a diamond in the rough. Let's see. I don't think he is, but you know what? Let's try. Uh, Alright! We're gonna hit him with the combo. Let's keep just bashing him. And then, hit him with an uppercut. We're gonna test both those damages. And then to finish it, or maybe to keep keep it... Just get it over with, we're gonna use a rage move. Hey, break! Let's fight a lawnmower. Go, 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 Not bad, not bad. Uh, this damage is not indicative of his, uh, weakness. Pow, that one is. All right, very nice. Go! Wasn't as good as just the consistent damage stream, but it's also pretty hard for him to get like that. Go, 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 Actually, because he is a boss and because he's so dense, it actually works out. Oh, okay, this is bad. Because he'll, he'll get it. Mm -hmm. When he gets low health, he'll get enraged and start pulling out a bunch of new tricks. But it all worked out. Look at that. Look at that thumbnail. Look at that thumbnail action. That is all I see. As soon as we kill the boss, everything in my brain is just like, Think of that thumbnail. Think of what is the perfect angle? Down low. Lower. There it is. There it is. You know how hard it is to find uh, thumbnails for a game that has no trailer, really? <laughs> it's impossible. Also, it doesn't look entirely appealing, so I have to always crank the gamma and shit to make it, like, blurrier, but also, like, oh, it's color. <laughs> it looks appealing to the eye. I bet my character's hungry. Go ahead and eat that tough in this room. How does that work? If we took off the mask, would we get, like, mo like twice the buff? Like, what if those mushrooms were, like, next-level defense? Like, we eat that mushroom, we become a god, but we can't really eat it because we have that stupid mask on our face. Also, wouldn't it be great if there was like a cutscene where he just takes off the mask and it's just nothing? <laughs> it's, it's literally just teeth and like flesh. It's just like, oh, fuck, please, please stop. Okay, so these enemies, well actually we, we killed that thing pretty quick. All right, hey, get over here. So apparently I have to like push you in a corner and then start going. Damn it, damn it. You'll probably just die real fast, yeah. No armor, yeah. Ra -ba 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 -da Pow! I mean, the weapon's decent, I suppose. I still don't think it's worth me, like, investing in a ton. No, see, I'm just destroying the durability <laughs> on it. Ooh, a contender for thumbnail, except it mostly was blurry, but... Yeah. <laughs> uh, what is this, rosewood? Walnut. Ugh. Yeah, I was actually hoping for someone to kill me. So have more enemies to fight. And counter hits. Oh shit, that actually worked. Counter hits. This is surprising me a lot. Yeah, you kind of got to get close enough because your character takes a step back in a weird way. Yeah, like you kind of got to get closer because he kind of leans. Yeah, he takes a giant leap backwards actually. Also, he definitely clears like... Like, halves himself, <laughs> so most weapons will block, or will be avoided. I mean, thumbs up. Yeah, I mean, if you guys didn't know, <laughs> it's a solid weapon. Uh, a really, anything, once you level it up, is pretty godly. Although, I will say, one of the things I was trying to say, but I would never got it out, when you're fighting that boss, um, because bosses don't stagger, uh, you can just lay into them. Like, you don't need to pinch them be behind a wall or something like that, which sometimes is what happens with enemies that are heavily armored, is you'll push them away. I love that. It's just so funny. <laughs> it's just like a little, like a pap, pap. Okay, never mind. In real. Go on. Take a step forward. <laughs> See what happens. <laughs> By the way, I think this is supposed to be a shake weight kind of a weapon. Like, it feels like it's that. <laughs> it's like, hey, what if we took a weapon and we basically just made a shake weight? How would, how would that even work? Oh! Was this the guy that wasn't a D-bag? I can't tell because he's dead, but was he the guy? 
that was sent to fighter after me? I don't know. But yeah, I was saying that a lot, not a lot of people who send fighters after you are kind anymore. They're all assholes. <laughs> but maybe he was the one. I mean, was he the I don't care. Who cares? <laughs> if it was, great. If he wasn't, then whatever. Who cares anyway? People are shitty. <laughs> it's obvious. That's gonna hit me. Yep. You can. There's a subtle difference. It's like a tone thing that you can hear within the, uh, within the thing. Nice. Sound effects. I don't know why. Noises. Sound effects. Random rolls of the tongue, like just happen with me. But it is certainly a thing. Um and uh, <laughs> translating that noise basically uh, adds up to being. I uh, appreciate you guys <laughs> for putting up with me <laughs> a lot. So by the way, uh, it's it's great. Like again, <laughs> any weapon that's like five star, pretty godly, <laughs> pretty godly. It's it's kit that really matters. Um, and this one, I don't know when it comes to your like your your um, alternative hits. I don't know about that one. That one to me seems like I it, it's good in certain situations, but it, it you're gonna have to get a really good dial in on what weapons work with it. Like what weapons are higher sweeping than others so that when you do crouch it does miss but with like the broadsword a broadsword uh slices in an x uh so even no, no matter how low you are you're gonna get smacked uh maybe if you're just skirting that edge it could miss mm, i don't know again you have to really like meticulously think about what weapons work and what weapons don't and another negative to the weapon is that it has a uh, force uh basically so it pushes them back um uh, has pushback which is actually quite bad when uh, when you're just when you want to damage anyone. Um, also, it takes a while for you to like pull your hand back. So maybe an enemy perfectly rushes you exactly when you drop your hand, or when your combination finally ends, and then wallop, you get hit. Uh, so another thing to consider. Yeah, I don't think it'd be a weapon I would use. So I'm actually not too upset that I haven't gotten it yet, because I probably wouldn't level it up. I still just kind of want a boxing kind of weapon. I still want my brass knuckles, and that dream has never died with me. It never will happen, most likely, <laughs> but it'd be cool <laughs> just to have it alive. Hope, hope remains. Also, I have no idea how the designers of this game feel about me. I don't think it's particularly great. <laughs> yeah. Like, personally, I, I love them. I love every, like, game that they're they've made. I totally, I gush about Shadows of the Damned and Killer is Dead. Tons. I love this game, but when it comes to, like, the implementation of microtransactions a lot of the time I'm pretty negative so I may they may hate me <laughs> I don't know regardless doesn't stop me from loving them <laughs> just I just disagree with a lot of their their uh, money making things not because I don't think that they should make money or that they don't have the right to do so but just because I don't think they do it in an effective way um, or if they do it ends up messing with the experience like yeah yeah like, like for instance a great example is like cosmetic stuff would be really cool in the game um, like just pants that had a base resource and stuff like that that I wish they would push. Like just a cool pair of jeans I think people would go nuts for. Or like it's just cosmetic based. And yes, you'd have to level it all the way up. Uh, maybe it's not even like, it's specifically not godly. You know what I mean? It's not like Forceman, but it is still good. Uh, stuff like that I think would be ways to do it. Also, to embed like, again, I think it'd be great if uh, the next big update that they had was a, a battle arena. And again, instead of going up, we went down. Um, and then we just went into like a badass battle arena where just people kept spawning, uh, weapons kept dropping. You could shout at your the top of your lungs and then the crowd of, I don't know, fallen haters or whatever would throw you weapons or have a chance of throwing you weapons. Like kind of like gladiator kind of thing. And then the higher, and then the longer that you would survive and the longer that you would go and the more waves you would last through, uh, you'd have a chance of like, of getting certain things based on you surviving to that degree. So if you survived five rounds, maybe you got access to uh, black metal. And then six or seven rounds, you got access to red metal. And then ten rounds, you got access to black metal. But ten rounds, it's like you're fighting two gods at once or some shit. That, that to me would be really cool. Um, and it would incentivize the use of death metals. Um, you actually being like, hey, in order to get to this certain point, I'm going to have to. <laughs> um, I, I'm so close to getting to the next bracket, the next wave. Let me use a death metal. And then you do that way. That, to me, would incentivize players to actually buy your game and market it pretty well. Um, but then again, it would also reward players that take the the initiative to like learn everything. To like um, know exactly what does what. Like, oh, this lever is red? Great. That spawns spikes on the wall. So if I tail these people around the, the edge of the arena, I pull this lever, spikes are going to come kill them. Great. Um, maybe it costs like 10,000 uh, 10, kill coins. So that way you can kind of 
you know, r rise the stakes or whatever. <laughs> Stuff like that. Those are those are the things that I wish that they would imply. And then, sure, pressure in terms of, uh, uh, or incentivize players with their currency. But with that being said, not, not for that to be the only way, of course. You could still get through it if you were very meticulous about it. Uh, that, to me, would be the, like, the events that I would want. But I'll probably never get that. But I just still, I like talking about stuff like that. I, back in the day, when I was a, a young lad, I, I really, my, my dream job uh, was to be a game, I, I don't know what it would be, a person that came up with the ideas and mechanics for games, but had like no fucking knowledge <laughs> about how to play them. Kind of a fucked up job. <laughs> or not how to play them, how to make them. Like just the guy who comes up with gameplay loops, gameplay story even. That was my dream job when I was like, 13 or something, <laughs> 10. Hey, I uh, come to find out it kind of exists, but probably doesn't. And you need to have like a bunch of backing to, to get it, like a bunch of previous or anyways <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching as always. If you guys didn't know already, the boxing gloves are extremely fun. Uh, they do have their faults, um, kind of, but more or less they're fantastic. Thank you guys so much for watching as always. My name is Logan and Dolph Frost. That is the end of this video. Thank you so much for your time and goodbye.